is one of the most difficult things that I've ever had to do. And I'm going to show you a video clip in a moment that gives you a great example of that. So go ahead and watch on. We're just going around to the back alley to see what happened with the tent after the tornado or windstorm or whatever. Okay. Yesterday it was up on the power lines. See right there? Okay, so it looks like we're going to be taking this apart. That's great. Just what I wanted to do. That tent right there is just like this tent right here. There's power over here. Huh? You walked right over it. Oh, the power line? Oh, yeah, that's great. Okay, so here we have the line that was broke. We called about it. They never called us back. There's two right there. So it got like stuck up in this, apparently. And then those lines are down right there. It goes all the way down. And it goes oh, up no, it over goes here. Like that. It right here, I think. Over here. And here's the, I think that's supposed to be connected somewhere, but it's, it's not. And here's $400 down at the drain. This is what $400 looks like when you spend it and then it's gone. It's not in power lines anymore though. Yeah. So. Looks like we're doing that. I don't know if, it likely can't be fixed, but it looks like we're gonna be cleaning it up. That's exciting. Um, that's it for now. So, um, wish us luck with the rest. <laughs> Over and out, peace out. Have a beautiful, wonderful, fantastic day, and love you. Thanks for watching. You see, my husband and I run a furniture refurbishing business. So what some people might call a hoard, we call inventory. And we had to put a lot of our inventory in some outside canopies, hence the canopy that you saw. And one day, the wind ended up actually picking up so much, it picked up that canopy, and took it over our fence into our alley and then took out everybody's internet. So that happened. Other than what I said before about the inspection, everything's going great, um, besides what I said about the inspection we got on the Victorian house, everything's going great there um, besides that inspection. Too. So keep watching. If you haven't seen the first part of this journey, I will link it in the description below and at the end screen so you can watch to keep up with the latest on my journey of buying a 19, or no, not 19 people, an 1890 house that is Victorian, that is my dream home, that I absolutely love and can't live without. You're going to go on the journey with my husband and I as we purchase that house, refurbish that house, and bring it back to its natural glory. If you'd like to help fund this, you may join my channel for exclusive content every first Saturday of the month. You will get to join a live stream in which I answer pretty much any question you would like. Um, in addition, I do have a GoFundMe. If you're curious as to why I do have these options, and especially the GoFundMe, um, be sure to watch the other video that's at the end screen. Other than that, I hope that if you got value out of the video, I could convince you to subscribe. I'm a stay-at-home mom, and I'd like to stay that way, and doing YouTube is a way to help me stay home with my children. In addition, a thumbs up would really help my channel. So if you just hit the button, we'd be great. Yes, you and I, we're besties now. Okay, unless you didn't hit the button. Um, I, don't, I don't know why you're still here if you didn't hit the button. But anyway, um, enough about that. I'll see you in the next video, and I'll see you in my Victorian house videos. What do I usually say? Peace? No? Have a beautiful, wonderful, fantastic day. I'll see you in the next video, and peace out.